7 Secrets to Stop Your Cat from Biting You Wandering in a deep jungle, you hear some noises in the tall trees. As you start to scout the area, you come face to face with a huge tiger. This giant tiger observes you as its next meal. Before you are able to move away, this giant cat suddenly pounces on you and bites your arm. While your cat may see itself as this giant tiger biting your arm, you see it as a tiny little feline who is misbehaving and causing you pain. Unfortunately, cat bites are both painful and inappropriate in the household. As we all would, our first instinct to try and fix this issue is to do a deep dive on the internet. If you found this video, then lucky you! We are going to show you 7 secrets to get your cat to stop biting. Before we can understand the secrets to tame these noble felines, we need to understand why cats bite. It's normal for young kittens to be a little mouthy, but usually they are taught manners by their older siblings and parents. To be more clear, the parent or siblings will let them know that their bites are painful. I wonder how many paw smacks in the face it takes to understand that biting hurts. As a cat gets older, they usually bite for different reasons. The three main reasons a cat will bite is either to show dominance or respond to some immediate threat. You can tell if this is the case if your cat bites and doesn't seem to back down. To stop unwanted behavior like overstimulating your cat, you can usually tell if your cat is biting to stop attention if the bite is not aggressive, doesn't puncture the skin, and remains rather calm to try and communicate with you. Some cats like to bite instead of meow to get your attention. You can tell if your cat is trying to speak with you through biting if you notice them trying to get you to follow them or something. This could be for play, food, etc. Now that we understand the basics of why your furry friends bite, let's uncover some ancient wisdom to stop and prevent these bites. Respond consistently. The first secret is to respond to your cat's bite consistently. When attempting to train your cat to bite less, it's important to always give the same response so that your cat can make the connection between their action and the response. Make sure that your family members or any visitors that come over also follow these responses so that the cat doesn't get confused. Don't let your body be a toy. While a lion or tiger may find your body as amusing as a chew toy, it's not appropriate for your little feline to act this way. It's best to not let your fingers, hands, or toes be used as toys for your cat. Honestly, you're asking for bites if you do this. I'm sure the ancient cat whispers learned the hard way. Our hearts are with you, friends. Get multiple interactive toys. Cats really love to play. To make sure your cat is satisfied, get at least three different toys so that your cat won't get bored. One great toy is where the cat has to fish out a treat. This keeps them occupied and rewards them for their consistency. Only a king or queen is fit to receive this treat. Praise your cat for being gentle. Make sure you give your cat positive reinforcement when they use their mouth to nibble lightly. But also, make sure you show them when they are biting too hard by making a noise or pulling away as a little kitten would. We all have a little cat in us, so channel your inner kitten to teach your feline manners. Don't pull away from an aggressive bite. If your cat bites you and doesn't let go, put on your alpha face and push your hand into the bite. This prompts the cat to stop biting you. Normally, we would try and pull our hand away from the pain, but this instinctively prompts the cat to bite harder. Remember, you are not a chew toy. Train replacement behavior. Simply put, this is to train your cat out of habits that include biting. For example, if your cat likes to bite your feet while you are sleeping, you could replace this behavior by training them to play with a toy and giving them a treat for it. Your beloved feline will associate playing with their toy with getting a treat. Mmm, ain't nothing like some temptations treats. Avoid physical punishment. I don't know how anyone can think of physically abusing their little masters, but sometimes it may seem like the only way to stop your cat from biting. However, physically attacking your cat may cause them to become much more aggressive. Instead of making them scared, they will want to play and bite more. 
What do you think of these secrets? Have any of these secrets prevented you from having battle scars from your furry warrior? Let us know in the comments. Like and subscribe if you've been bitten by your cat, and also use one of these secrets to help your cat stop biting. Don't forget to ring the notification bell so you get the latest updates. See you later!